They seem to be resistant to poison, so don't cast that on them. Anyways, they go down fairly easy enough. Star patterns and charts are carved into the side of the granite head. Drop 5,000 gold pieces in my mouth and I will teach you the ways of astrology, okay? Yes. Um, I believe astrology is very important to druids. Not enough gold in the party. Well, so much for that. Druidic symbols are carved on the side of the mysterious moon. Shrine of the Seasons. I don't know what that does, but that's more gems than I'm willing to donate. I mean, it might be useful for some people, but not for me right yet. We don't have the supplies to be able to properly give them what they seek. So let's head back west, across here. Drink from this. Yes, water is quite refreshing. Alright, there's only one other place I wanted to explore, and that would be down south of here. Notice inside of Orc Meadow how it's all filled with trees of all kinds. That means a very good chance for us to use our pathfinding to gain us some treasure. Yes. So remember to search the trees of Orc Meadow and such. They will give you some rather handy items. And if not, well, you can always sell it off for gold. And gold is at a premium inside this game. Never forget that. too far east. You don't want to head into a new area just yet. And there's a hut inside this tree. Sure. Hut collapses around you. Oof. Okay. Don't head inside that hut. That hut will just hurt you. Continue searching through these trees. Yes, search inside. Simple implements of peasantry are the hut's only occupants. Ha! Huh, for once, a hut that doesn't do anything just is the peasant's house. A brooch, broach, brooch, brooch. However you pronounce that. And that does it for Orc Meadow. Now, the only other thing for us to do is to head back north. And we are going to investigate the Cult of Moo. You might think I'm being funny, I'm not. That is the name of the cult, the Cult of Moo. Don't ask me why Kanigan likes to make games with um, strange cult names like that, but whatever. Horrid carvings in the wooden floor mark the entrance to a dark temple. Enter? Yes. And it is dark again. Cast light. Eep. Cast energy blast and shoot that sucker. 45 gems from just a single skeleton. Alright. I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain because the more gems, the better. Broken skeleton lies on the floor. Mm hmm. Well, we already have light, so let's not worry about that. Let's check the notes for this. The Ancient Temple of Mu. The halls of the Ancient Temple of Mu were filled with undead warriors that were once glory seekers come to witness the statue of Firemane, mascot of Mu. Ah, it'll transform all of us into crusaders. The 
bones of those strong enough to resist the reanimating magic of the Cleric of Moo litter the floor. Skeletons! Die, skeleton. Alright, it looks like they're going to single out the Cleric, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play it smart. And if you're smart, you will too. See this favored? Cast it on the cleric of the party. That'll give her a large room of, or a large margin of error. Um, it'll give her a whole bunch of AC and such. And whenever they go to hit her, they won't hit her as hard, or they'll dismiss entirely. And you can find a sacred silver skull just by looking around down here. Um, let's break this down. And allow me to pause it real quick. Okay, still continuing with my playthrough. Zombies! Oh, pfft. Okay, I get the idea. Let me cast a spell. Oi. New cast spell levitate. Cast levitate in here because these pits are hidden. Skeletons. Now see, if you know what certain monsters are going to attack like that, you can get away with just buffing only a few party members and it'll be just pretty much the exact same thing as having it cast on everybody. Acid stream. Yikes. Cast Nature's Cure. I'm not liking how this is turning out. Cast New. Turn Undead. That's the reason why they always go for the Cleric. Die, you skeleton. Again, I really do think that they accidentally switched out the lich graphics for the skeleton graphics, but whatever. And that's why you cast Levitate. Nothing. And as you can see, there's a skeleton in the back there. deal with his kind. Alright, I guess the skeletons are just really that fast. Um... I guess. 